हेलो फ्रेंड्स हियर वी विल डिस्कस दी प्रॉब्लम बेस्ड ऑन दी हॉरिजॉन्टल एंड वर्टिकल डिस्टर्बेंसेस सो फ्रेंड्स सी द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट फर्स्ट लॉन्ग पोजीशन इन सिक्योरिटीज विथ रिमेनिंग मैच्योरिटी ऑफ दी टू इयर्स हैविंग अ मार्केट कैपिटल चार्ज ऑफ हंड्रेड क्रोर्स एंड दे हैव स्टेटेड इट इज इन दी जोन टू लॉन्ग पोजिशन इन द सिक्योरिटी विथ रिमेनिंग मैच्योरिटी फाइव ईयर्स हैविंग कैपिटल चार्ज फोर फिफ्टी and in zone 3 next the short position due to derivative with remaining maturity of a 6 month having a market risk capital charge 100 cr which is in the zone 1 and last statement the short position due to the derivative remaining maturity 2 years having a capital charge 50 crores zone 2 so friends see here and they are asking find out total capital charge for the market risk and they are also asking find vertical disallowance and horizontal disallowance okay so that we have to calculate now friends see what do you mean by it first understand what is a long position long position means simply you purchase it for 500 you purchase the share of reliance for 500 and you are expecting after 2 year it will become 1000 and you can gain a money this is the long position right you are purchasing and you are selling at a high price that is called as the long position what is short position short position means what you are also making money in the short position but how you are selling here right so you uh, know that the reliance share is now 500 it will go to 250 right so you will sell the shares of 500 instead of future today itself which you are not having already right this is called as the short position means you are not having the shares still you are selling and you are planning to purchase in the future right at the lowest price so this is nothing but the short position right so you are having fear that you will uh, uh, the reliance share price will decrease in the future so today price is 500 but you don't have the share still you can share it that is called as oversold position still you can share, sell the shares and you will plan that you will buy in the future at lowest rate this is the short position so in the both cases you can earn the money so this is uh, forget about the long and short simply remember when there is a long position you should take 100 which is the positive sign when there is long position you should take positive sign 450 when there is short position you should take a minus sign when there is short position you take the minus sign okay got it now what about zone zone is in the question they have provided if not provided then then it is also very easy see zones are calculated based on the remaining maturity based on the remaining maturity now here you simply remember long means you have to take a plus long means you have to take plus short means you have to take minus short means you have to take minus of what capital charge capital charge capital charge capital charge okay now see here don't worry about this table just go through it okay this is a standard table from the rbi for the horizontal disallowance now see friends zone 1 is the time period for the remaining maturity of the asset having one month and so on right but you only remember very simply up to the 12 months zone 1 is up to the 12 months zone 2 is 1 to 3.6 year 1 to 3.6 year and zone 3 is uh, beyond 3.6 years very easy zone 1 up to 1 year zone 2 up to 3.6 and zone 3 beyond 3.6 year very easy you can easily remember now friends see here when you are adjusting between two zones that is zone 1 and zone 2 or zone 2 and zone 3 that means nearby zones the you have to take the 40% remember only okay when you solve the problem that time you will get it better but when you shift or adjust from one zone to the uh, living one zone that means when you adjust between zone 1 and zone 3 living zone 2 you have to take 100% very easy what i have told you zone 1 and 2 you are dealing with you take the 40% zone 2 and 3 you are dealing take 40% but if you are dealing with 1 and 3 right skipping 2 so you take 100% only remember this okay now see here 
I have already given in the short way how to how to find the zone up to one year take a zone one one to three point six take a two and three point six above you take a zone three only three zones are there vertical disallowance you have to take a five percent okay now see if you are dealing within a zone if you are dealing within zone for example in zone three there are two value fifty cr and for this time we get hundred cr so you have to take only five percent so forget about this okay when you dealing with the within the zone you have to take a five percent as the charge okay now see here what i have written here you just simply tell me what i have written zone one six month maturity is remaining it is a short position so minus hundred zone two two year remaining maturity long position so plus hundred zone two again two year remaining maturity minus 50 means short position zone 3 five year remaining maturity 450 long position so plus so what i have written there simply what is given here that i have written see zone 2 100 cr two years right remaining maturity so i have written here two right so it is a long position so plus 2 so plus 450 so it is short position so minus 100 short position so minus 50 so zone 1 zone 2 zone 3 and zone 2 okay so i have written the same what is given in the problem statement the same thing i have written in the tabular format to get the clarity okay so this is the given data right zone 1 zone 2 zone 3 zone and uh, zone 2 zone 3 this is the given data i think it is very much clear now we will move to how to solve the problem see the solution part see this is given data right this is the given data right now first step you should start with the zones which are having same or um, uh, see zone 2 is repeated here for zone 2 we are having two year time bucket for long 100 cr position and again for same two years maturity we are having a short of 50 cr so this is given right so i can write <coughs> first step what you have to do within zone we will adjust within zone we will adjust so that 100 i can write a plus 50 plus 50 right this is plus so don't forget about the signs so plus you have to take always a plus so 100 i can write plus 50 plus 50 right so i have to adjust with uh, within the zone okay so you can see the yellow mark so this plus 50 remember always remember while adjusting plus and minus only can be adjusted you simply remember men and women are going to be married right so plus minus so here plus 50 plus 50 i can write for the plus 100 here for a minus 50 right it is uh, given so simply it is a minus 50 now see this plus 50 this minus 50 i will take a uh, only the 50 don't i will now uh, simply i uh, i can say i am cancelling this you remember i am cancelling this because they got married plus 50 minus 50 so they got married so i will simply take a 50 which is i have uh, cancelled 50 okay it is within the group it is within the zone so i have to take here five percent it is the standard so it will be 2.5 cr and this is nothing but your vertical disallowance because within the zone you are adjusted it right now what is remaining here here remaining is uh, plus 50 i have taken it as a carry forward okay now with what uh, with whom should i adjust that plus 50 obviously to the nearest okay so zone 1 i am having minus 100 okay so minus 100 always remember you can adjust only minus and plus not else okay now see here this plus 50 i have to adjust so we i will adjust this with the nearest so zone 2 is nearest is zone 1 so in zone 1 we are having minus 100 i can write this as a minus 50 minus 50 okay i can write no problem minus 50 minus 50 right so this minus 50 and this plus 50 gets uh, netted against each other so i will have a 50 okay which is i have cut here i have taken separately 50 right this 50 i have taken here okay for simplicity this minus 50 this plus 50 i have taken here 50 because they got cancelled they have netted so when you do the netting against 
two different zone or adjacent adjacent zones you have to take the 40 percent okay zone one and zone two so i am taking here 40 percent so here, here you will get the uh, here you will get the 50 into 40 so uh, 5 4 is a 20 so here 20 cr will be your capital charge got it first we have take uh, calculated within the zone i repeat the steps first step 100 within zone is a so we are having two zones zone 2 2 right so it will be within the zone so it is a vertical disallowance so plus 100 i can write a plus 50 plus 50 and uh, here is minus 50 so this plus 50 goes with the minus 50 there is a net thing is being done so 50 netting is done so 50 into 5 percent within the zone 5 percent so answer is 2.5 percent for the vertical disallowance now uh, the remaining is plus 50 in this zone uh, that i should uh, net against the nearest zone so this is we are having nearest zone minus 100 is there i can write minus 50 minus 50 so this minus 50 and this plus 50 gets netted so we are netting zone 1 and zone 2 values so when we are dealing with zone 1 and 2 or 2 and 3 that is nearest zone we have to take the 40 percent so it will be 20 cr so here zone uh, 1 and 2 we are dealing so it will be 20 cr okay now next step what is remaining here this got cancelled so remaining is minus 50 so in this nothing is remain in this uh, my, there is a minus 50 which is already being cancelled in the first step itself so here is also nothing remain so in zone 3 we are remaining with the plus 40 uh, plus 450 so plus 450 i can write plus 400 plus 50 right so that minus 50 get again netted with the this plus 50 right so i can write netting 50 is being done so 50 into zone 1 and 3 you are dealing so you are dealing uh, skipping one zone right so here you have to have take 100 percent as i have already told you so answer here will be 50 cr so what is remaining and lastly we are remaining with the 400 okay so what is the horizontal disallowance vertical disallowance we are getting in this within the zone that is zone 2 zone 2 right so 2 point cr will be your vertical disallowance what is a horizontal disallowance first we have calculated 20 cr and secondly we have calculated that 50 cr so total is a 70 cr which is your horizontal disallowance okay now they are asking total they are asking what is the total capital charge so vertical we got 2.5 horizontal we got here 70 and the remaining 400 and the remaining is 400 okay so total will be 472.5 cr okay how to find that uh, remaining that also you have other way if you uh, you have to check how can you check see this uh, this is the given values right so this is this is uh, see here how to find the remaining other way plus 100 minus 100 what cancel and uh, when you uh, net this minus 50 plus 450 remaining is 400 so you can check in this way also your calculations okay so friends i repeat very easy it is very easy first you do within the zone zone 2 zone 2 right within zone so it is a vertical disallowance so it is always a 5 percent okay so 150 netting is being done this minus 50 plus 50 got cancelled okay so it is a 2.5 cr 50 into 5 percent we are taking the value which is being netted so 50 common so you have to take here 50 okay remaining is 50 now that 50 i will net again uh, with the nearest so nearest is uh, zone 1 and obviously it is plus 50 you cannot do uh, netting with a plus 450 because plus plus you should do the netting plus and a minus so 100 minus 100 i can write minus 50 minus 50 minus 50 plus 50 got cancelled so we have done the netting of plus and minus 50 so 50 into 40 percent why because uh, inter zone we are dealing there is a zone 1 and zone 2 we are dealing when we deal with the nearest zone we have to take the 40 percent okay so it is 20 cr again remaining here is a, a minus 50 and we are having remaining uh, plus 450 okay when you do the netting of minus 50 plus 50 we are uh, doing the netting of the zone 1 and 3 skipping one zone so you have to take the 100 percent 100 percent of 50 will be uh, 50 so this is your horizontal disallowance which is 70 cr and uh, 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 vertical we have covered 2.5 total will be uh, 2.5 plus 70 plus remaining 400 
so total will be 472.5 that will be your final total capital charge on the market risk okay so in this way you have to deal okay i have told you here in the beginning see here when you are dealing with a zone 1 and zone 2 40 percent when you are dealing with zone 2 and 3 40 percent but you are dealing with zone 1 and 3 you have to take 100 percent right which we have already discussed here okay in this way this is a very easy problem you don't need to worry about it in the exam also you will get if they are providing you the zones it is very good if they are not providing the zones then also there is a shortcut you simply remember in this way okay zone 1 zone 2 zone 3 okay there may only maturity remember you can easily get the solution so continue we'll continue with our discussion in the next uh, case study all the best and don't forget to download the application on the play store